Now we have an infrared phototransistor. Okay. Obviously of sensitive delight in the room. What's really cool about using this is just a simple fact that wireless remote can be tested. All the buttons can be tested. Make sure your LEDs working. I mean, a lot of times the LEDs get bumped and come off the circuit board. Well, it's just a good way to test if your battery's good or whatever. Yeah, I got the little infrared photo transistor out of an old VCR. You can get them, you know, buy a bag of them nowadays. Um, also, I've got a transformer. It's a Muzak transformer from a previous project. And uh, it's connected to a speaker. I haven't rehearsed this. Let's see what happens. Okay, that's the high impedance primary. Going through different ones. I've got the speaker connected. You can maybe you can hear the bass rumble of the 60 cycles from the test probe. There's a lower impedance. Okay. Also, I can. Uh, Go to the uh, secondary of the transformer and disconnecting the speaker. And you can see some of the wilder inductor properties. Have a good inductor. Really not. Uh, I, I suppose the best uh, purpose for this is continuity. But it's nice you can uh, connect it to a speaker and hear the speaker, you know, or at least know you're on the right wires. Well, that's it for now.